Well, welcome to an NCAA.com Skype session. I'm Andy Katz. Pleased to be joined by Rob Fennessy from Indiana after hitting the shot of the day, maybe the shot of the season, certainly for Indiana, maybe in college basketball as the Hoosiers knock off Butler at the buzzer in the Crossroads Classic in Indianapolis. Rob, that last couple of seconds, it had the appearance, just watching it from afar, like it was a little helter-skelter. How much were you aware that you needed the ball back because the time was essentially running out? Uh, yeah, that was it. Obviously, that wasn't the play that was drawn up, but I saw Devontae pick up his dribble and Romeo was being denied. And, uh, I think it was about two or three seconds when I slid over to get the ball. I knew I had to get a shot up to have a chance to win. All right, so what was the play that was designed? Uh, really just like a, a slice play for Romeo to get the ball and have isolation. I got to believe, and I heard your post-game interview, that you've never hit a bigger shot in your life. Um, yeah. It happens so fast. Now that you've had some minutes after the game, news conference, get a chance to get dressed, absorb it for me. What does it mean to you to hit a shot like that? You're from the state of Indiana in Indianapolis to win a game like that. It's what everyone dreams of. Yeah, it is. I mean, I've grown up, grew up watching this, the Crossroads Classic, so just being able to play in this environment and playing uh, Banger's Life is a big thing for me, and in that shot, and I'll remember that for the rest of my life. So you hit three threes today, none bigger than that last one. Uh, only one turnover, and I'm thinking back to that Duke game when you had four. You're only a freshman. How much have you improved at that position since that Duke game? Uh, I've improved a lot, just learning from that game, um, being more aggressive, being more assertive in the offense. So just watching film on that with Coach really helped me. You know, you guys have done a great job of finishing games lately. You think back to Louisville, to Northwestern. What is it about this younger group, and I know you have the veteran in Juwan Morgan, but for the most part, a younger group that can handle that adversity, that late possession type of basketball game? Oh, really, we just try to lock in, and um, we look to our leaders, Juwan and Zach, and um, some of the other veteran guys to help us through it. So them and the coaches have really helped us just, just push through in the, the heat of the moment, and it really helps. So what have your teammates uh, told you in the last uh, hour, or last, less than that, but you know, since you hit the shot? Uh, just big shot. I mean, we can't just focus on that shot. I know it's a huge shot, but we have to look forward to the next game and keep winning. All right. So to that point, you know, this is a team that continues to get better. And I remember talking to Archie, you know, in the preseason that part of the sort of the difference that had to occur with this group from last season was defending that this group had to defend better than a year ago. I know you weren't there a year ago, but how have you seen the buy-in defensively, to allow you guys to finish these games and be a much better basketball team than that team was a year ago? Uh, a lot. I mean, we focus on it a lot in practice. We do a lot of different drills that um, help us during the game and just different personnel uh, of against who we're playing against. So just locking it in and playing team defense really helps. Well, Rob, the only thing bigger would be to hit a shot like that in March. Uh, this is going to go down in Indiana lore. Uh, how much are you looking forward to maybe being in that position sometime in a few months from now? Oh, I'm really looking forward to it. Just like I said, growing up, I've always watched college basketball. And um, I mean, nothing was bigger than that shot right there. So I'm just going to try to keep winning and hopefully we can get there in March. I'll tell you, Christian Watford's got to run for his money. He hit that big <laughs> shot in Bloomington against Kentucky. The only difference here, different opponent I know. And he didn't have yeah. the court storm because of what is in Bloomington. But this one's going down, certainly, in Indiana history. Congratulations, Rob. Yes, sir. Thank you.